For a while, I, I wanted to do a video on uh, people's attitudes and behavior and how sometimes people are perceived wrong. You go over to somebody and you say, good morning, and they pass you by. They don't say anything. And a lot of people say, well, who do they think they are? And uh, I find that <laughs> it, it's not to judge somebody else because a lot of people live in silent desperation. They have a sick relative or they're having financial problems or, or they're having problems uh, with relationships. They're worried about uh, their spouse or they're lonely or, or whatever. And you don't know what uh, somebody else is going through. And they maybe seem uh, distant and like they're not in the same world with you and they may um, not be as responsive. And so a lot of people, their reaction to such things are, who do they think they are? Uh, I won't say good morning to them anymore. Why should I be nice if they're not nice and this kind of thing? And what I would say to people is cut people a little bit of a break, give them a little bit of rope, and give them a little bit of slack. And that you don't know that they could be living in silent desperation. They may have an illness or a family problem or a financial problem or a relationship problem or a problem with their job. You don't know what they're going through. And it'd be good to give people a little bit of a break. Uh, I know they're not what we want them to be, but maybe we're not what they want us to be. So you can't judge a, a book by the cover sometimes. Sometimes what's in the pages of their life may really tell the story, and you might not know the story, so you can't really judge them. Uh, the old thing about walking in a, somebody else's moccasins might change your view and opinion of things. So I would say uh, give people a little bit of slack. L cut them a little bit of break. Give them a little bit of rope. And and be kind to them. Uh, if, you, if you have two people that aren't kind to each other, you have a war. So if one person's not living up to the... Uh, expectation of maintaining relationships let the other person be the big person and we'll see how things turn out